YouTube. We're back in for more of our Gen Con Bonanza Explosion Blood coverage. We are live at Gen Con 2018. Thanks in part to all of our amazing Kickstarter backers, five year runnings. Thank you for sending us each and every year. And of course, these companies right here who donated games for our Kickstarter. Huge thanks to them. And our big sponsors, Tasty Mitchell Games and Minion Games. Right now, I actually met Emily last night. We're about to talk to Emily, and she was handing out these things. She was like, hey, do you guys want of these? And I was like, what is this? This is super cool. She has her own company called Critical Hit Design, and I'm just gonna let her talk about all the cool stuff she does. Uh, well, professionally I'm a graphic designer, but um, that's just how I earn some money. Uh, otherwise, I have an Etsy store where I create, uh, lately I've been creating dice bags, but I also have these little mini meeples, and I have um, <laughs> meeple purse kind of thing that I do. Wait, you made that? I made this. That is awesome. Okay. So I'm a little bit of a Doctor Who fan. Okay. Uh, so I made that for myself. I've made a uh, squirrel dice bag for Marty and Tony from Rolling Dice and Taking Names as a surprise for them, and they really liked it. And then somebody else saw that and wanted another squirrel, so I made that for them um, with a little acorn. But for Marty and Tony, of course, I made a little moon pie for the squirrel to hold. And uh, I made a McCall parrot. It was also a dice bag. And then I have plans to make a few others that I, uh, for different people that I just want to... I mean, it's fun for me because I make the pattern myself. So that's the challenge of designing that pattern and, and making it work. So I enjoy doing that. But then once I'm done, I need something to do with it. So I need, you know, an outlet for that, So which is why I have my Etsy store. So I can have a place where I can be creative and make things, but then have somebody that will appreciate it afterwards. So that's been fun for me. And, and this is a very limited amount of the stuff. Like the, you said there's 10 stickers, right? Uh, I ordered 10 of the stickers. There's more things on Redbubble. Um, most of them are board game related. Some things are just things that I just wanted to draw. Uh, so there's 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 quite a few, few things up there on Redbubble. But yeah, I had, um, uh, for board game related stuff, I had one that was from the Board Game Survive. And I actually did send it to Stephen Bonacore, make sure it was all okay, and I wasn't stepping on anybody's toes or anything, and he, and he approved it. That so, was the one I picked out. It's really stinking cool. Yeah. It says I will survive on it, so you know every time you see it, you get the song stuck in your head. <laughs> um, it's just different things I like, and then there, there was a. Uh, this was one of the first things I did was these uh, meeple guys, because we're big into D and D and we play. So I have the barbarian and the cleric, and I also have a wizard and um, a ranger. Uh, and I was, I was talking to you a, bit, a little bit earlier. These are like really high quality stickers, correct? Yeah, Redbubble. They're really nice. They're, they're, they, they stick pretty well on things. Yeah, I'm, I'm planning on putting mine on my car because I think that is seriously, I feel like bumper stickers for board games would be huge. But um, we will put the, the Etsy link down below, but anything else you want to shout out about? Um, I hadn't thought of anything. Uh, no. No worries. Uh, yeah. And then, if you want to check out this stuff, uh, I was checking out the Etsy store. Lots of cool stuff. Check it out in the link down below and the critical hit design, which I'll post down below as well. Thank you very much for the interview. And if you're enjoying the Gen Con coverage, please be sure to click on that subscribe button down below. And in the comments below, let me know what's your bar food of choice. If you can get anything in a bar, what do you want to eat? Oh, I love pretzels. Pretzels? Nice. Like the uh, the big fluffy oh, ones the, or the hard yeah, ones? Yeah, the, the big, nice. uh, yeah, soft ones. I like chili cheese fries, but, but only if they're done the right way. Chili cheese fries. Let me know in the comments below what is your bar food of choice. And as always, thanks for your time, YouTube.